Crawford on the high seas. How many are familiar with the old three shell game? How many of you have won at the three shell game? You must be cheap. You must be dealing the three shell game. The only people that actually make money in the three shell game are the guys actually presenting it. For those people not familiar, usually it's classically done with three walnut shells and a pea. And they'll put the pea underneath one of the shells, mix them around, and you've got to figure out for your money which shell, which pea the shell is under, which shell the pea is under. I'll get it eventually. All right. The thing is, he died behind the table as an underhanded, bottom-feeding criminal scum. He cheats completely. Even if you get it right, by the time he raises up that shell, that bowl will be gone. Great thing to watch from a distance. But in this case, the guy behind the table, who wasn't showed you how to make a million dollars. Friend, I'm not feeling the love. All right. <laughs> and not only that, your chances are not one B, three shells, it's one and three. In this game, there are three cups, three, three balls, your chances of winning are 75%. So, all we need is somebody to take advantage of this pecuniary opportunity. We'll hold on, we'll play for your college education. How's that? Well, what's going to happen is basically the balls are going to poof, vanish, but they'll always appear back underneath the cup. I guarantee there'll always be a ball either on top of or underneath the cup. You can take that to the bank. That is, if they still exist in the next few weeks. <laughs> the whole new U.S. bank of piracy is forming right here. <laughs> but anyway, if anybody out there wants to take advantage of this, the bigger the bill, the funnier this will be. I oh, no, won't be bringing people up for this. This is a solo park, really. All I need is to see your money waving madly. <laughs> All right, I know, it takes confidence. That's part of the confidence game, building your confidence. So what's going to happen? I'll be making balls, poof, vanish, the sound of crickets. You guys realize this is an interactive show. A spin, a tap, poof, gone. Yes, yes. Oh, just a blow. No, nothing's happened. You guys are watching way too closely now. <laughs> Let me try that again. You gotta blink once in a while. It's good for the eyes. <laughs> That's gonna hurt. Tomorrow. <laughs> Sir! A, B, or C. No money on the table at this point. Just gentlemen's bet. A, B, or C. B! From my left and from my right. <laughs> this one here. You would have been a winner. Anything you had in your pockets, I would have let you keep. Because that's the part of way. You don't actually make any money, but as I said before, anywhere along there, you would have won. I'm a man of my word. In fact, can you guys hear that way back there? Can you hear that bell ringing? Yes. This is going up. Perfect. Good. All right. Good. You got these steel on steel. This time, hopefully, you guys will see the pecuniary possibilities in this. So. Thank you very much, excellent. A spin, a top, poof! I'm going to try something though, I'm just going to pick up this ball, drop it so thusly. <laughs> About the same response, yeah. right? <laughs> Hold on a second, yeah. Right. Oh, no. It's broken, sorry. <laughs> a, B, or C, sir? A! This one is A to this one. Anywhere along there, 